Um, definitely being a six year, um, you know, a lot of the weight is on the older guys to, you know, keep everybody positive, keep everybody up, and you know, keep coming to practice with the same mentality as we did when we started the year. So I think that falls on, you know, not only me but the rest of the leaders, the rest of the captains on the team. Yeah, um, you know, from a tight end standpoint, um, you know, it's just doing the little things a little bit better. Um, you know, we've been getting on the right guy, but it's about, you know, executing and actually finishing the blocks and, um, you know, just trying to open up some holes for running backs back there. Um, everybody's being coached up, um, O-line, tight ends, running backs. There's trust in the hole, um, trust in your, your training, and then just you know, being more physical and, you know, just trying to attack the defense a little bit more. I would say there's more sense of urgency. Um, obviously, we know we got to get stuff fixed, and we got to get it fixed quick if we want to accomplish the goals that we, we set out to do at the beginning of the season. Um, but, you know, just sense of urgency. Uh, you can feel that from the coaches all the way down through the players. They're just trying to, you know, we always say attack every rep, but really, it's we, we got to attack every rep now. I mean, obviously, it's a little fl frustrating, but as offense as a whole, we, we haven't held up our end of the deal um, either. So uh, it just comes back to execution and, uh, you know, trusting the training, trusting the coaches, the game plan. And, you know, we will, we will figure this, this stuff out. Um, I was here back in 2017. Um, I think we went 10 and 3, 11 and 2 that year, and then come back the next year we were 6 and 6. So I've I've been through this before, and uh, you know tough times don't last. Uh, Coach Tuck says it all the time. Tough people do, and we got some tough guys in the room. Yeah, obviously it's difficult to to find a rhythm when we're not out there, um, but when we are out there, we got to do a better job executing. Uh, we haven't had a good first couple drives the past couple games, and I think that's hurt us. So we just got to start faster. Yeah, we're we're uh, trying to get things differently, trying to spread spread us out a little bit more, create some more space. Um, I haven't been in twelve personnel a lot. We got some bigger bodies out there. Um, uh, we think it'll just you know, a different way to get into to the things that we we normally run out of twelve personnel. So I think we, I think we're just starting it a little sooner. Um, we we know the offense a little bit better this year. Um, so it, it's easier to get to that sooner in the season. Uh, we, we did a lot of the same things last year, but towards the end of the season. Yeah, um, <clears throat> in our offense, um, you know, we have some opportunity to make explosive plays, um, but it's about when we are in those positions actually executing. Um, you know, we haven't had many explosive plays the past two games, and uh, you know when. When us as tight ends find ourselves in there, we gotta we gotta make plays, whether that's you know, make making the catch or you know if we can get some yak, you know that can turn into an explosive play too. So it's all about just you know, being more physical, being you know have a better sense of urgency when we're out there. Um, you know, P P Peyton's not a guy that you know, we really gotta you know sit and watch him and bring him up all the time. He's a leader on the team and he's gonna continue to lead no matter what his play is on the field. Um, you know, but obviously there's going to be a sense of sense of maybe hesitation. He got hit a lot in the Washington game, and uh, you know when you're back there patting the ball, obviously there's there's a quarterback. You you know you feel that. So it, it's not about picking him up all the time because he's he's going to be up and he's he's going to lead no matter what what spot he's in, playing good, playing bad. So it's just about again executing. And that's everybody. It's not just Peyton, because if you, if you really watch the film, you know a lot of times it wasn't just one guy not executing, and it wasn't just like one play here or there. It was you know things across the board. So we gotta we gotta pick that up. Um, you know again the the leaders on the defense, it, it comes from them, and you know picking everybody up, picking everybody up, uh, especially the younger guys. And I've got some young guys playing, but. You know, it's just back to the sense of urgency. Like, we don't have time to, to waste anymore. We don't have, yeah. You look at the games that are left on our schedule. You know, it's, it's, it's a tough stretch. And uh, the good thing is, is that anybody can get beat on any given day. And I know that, you know, last game is what it is. But going forward, we got to have a better sense of urgency and, you know, execution. We got to be on point.